your burp gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. Row, row, row your boat gently up the creek. If you see a little mouse, don't forget to squeak. Your boat gently to the shore. If you see a lion, don't forget to roar. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. If you see a crocodile, don't forget to scream. Our judges today are Zizi, Fernando, Rihanna, and Hippo. Hi, Grandpa Zizi. Who is the first act? The Counts. He'll be back later. The crowd is going wild. Judges, what do you think? Did the cows do well? The winner gets to ride on the big red shiny tractor. So, how did the cows do? Let's see what the judges think. Not bad. Who's next? The dancing donkeys. as good as the cows, but a big watermelon from Hippo. Oh dear, mixed feelings amongst the judges. Quickly, who's the next act, Grandpa? Comedy ducks? Interesting. The judges do look a little curious. Okay, I think they're starting. Well, that was different. <laughs> Judges, what's the verdict? Well, at least they got an apple. A chicken? I love chickens. I bet this is a magic act. I wonder what she's going to do. Wow, that is magic. Judges? Hippo is proving very hard to please. So, who do you think's won? Who won? The cows, the ducks, the donkeys, or the chickens? Grandpa, you won! And you get to ride your shiny red tractor around the farm. Wow! The cow's back!
Everyone, what are you all doing? Wow, that looks like... Oh, you went to Egypt to meet the president! And you're building the great pyramids of Zizi and Rihanna! Nice! If only the ancient Egyptians had you two! Their job would have been so much easier! Hippo, it's almost lunchtime! Shish! Is that a rocket? Are you planning to go to the moon? Ah, you went to Paris and had lunch with the president. And you're building the Eiffel Tower. It's taller than you, Shish. The tower, I mean. The baguette is looking much shorter now. Hmm. Fernando, what are you building? It's not very straight. Of course, you met the Prime Minister of Italy next to the Leaning Tower of Pisa. Hippo, it does sound a bit like pizza, but I meant Pisa, a famous town in Italy. Hippo, you do know that pizza comes from Italy. Have you all been to visit famous places and meet important people? Hattie, did you go anywhere? Wow, where did she go? Zizi, do you know? How about you get the globe and show us where everyone has travelled to? Pussycat, they want you to play 
Hopscotch or skipping, it's your choice today. Wow, that's a big globe. Show us where everyone's been. Go on, Zizi. Give it a spin. Giza is in Egypt, where we can find the pyramids. Zizi and Rihanna went to the pyramids. Paris in France is where you can find the Eiffel Tower. Hippo and Shish went to the Eiffel Tower. Where else did they go? Pisa is in Italy, where you can find the leaning tower of Pisa. Fernando, shouldn't the tower be leaning? That's much better. London, England. Who went to London? Hattie, did you go to London to visit the Queen? Did you take her crown? I don't think she's going to be very happy about that. <laughs> See you next time! Well, this is strange. Where is everybody? One, two, three, four, and that makes five. It's D, the dinosaur. It looks like it wants to play. I wonder if it knows any tricks. Sit. Turn around. What a lovely pirouette. Roll over. <laughs> well done. Can it fetch? Wow. Look at that bone fly. It landed in some clay. That was a mighty throw, Zizi. I wonder if we could use the clay to make something. Hippo, you've made a shape. A triangle. Can anyone else make a shape? Rihanna's made a rectangle. Fernando, you've made a bone. <laughs> Very good. And you created a shape, Zizi. What is it? A circle. I think Dee wants to play fetch again. What was that noise? Ah, it's Grandpa. Did you have an accident, Grandpa? He's building something. It's your new invention. Isn't it missing something? It needs wheels. Hmm, what shape would be good for a wheel? Hippo, Rihanna, Fernando and Zizi. Quickly, get your shapes and let's see if they'd be any good as wheels. And Zizi, you never know. The circle might be just right. Give a dog a bone, this old man has cracked a stone. This old man, he played two, ZZ wants to join in two. With a nick knack paddy whack, give a dog a bone, Grandpa's happy he's not alone.
see if we can help Grandpa find the right shape. The dinosaur can fetch them. Go fetch, Dee. What's that shape? Would it be good as a wheel? No, that will not make a good wheel. What shape is this? Could it be good for a wheel? A triangle? I don't think so. What shape's this? Could it be good for a wheel? A circle? Oh, that would be the perfect shape for a wheel. What's that? It's Grandpa driving his car. Look at them go in his shiny new wheels. Well done, Grandpa. Like you need a trim for the long summer ahead. Hello, Zizi the barber. Nice work on Leo the lion. Just a trim today. Ah, you'd like to look just like Leo. Well, that's different. Hmm, perhaps something less exotic? Shish, it's summer! Wouldn't you feel more cool with a shorter cut? You look like a hound dog, and that's much cooler for the summer. Okay, okay. Zizi, short back and sides, quick. What do you think? Zizi, back to the drawing board. <laughs> Cool and ready for the summer! Great work, Hippo! You've swept up all Shush's wool! Shish, what could you do with all that coloured wool? Great idea! Go and give everyone your wool! You look great with your new haircut! 
An amazing barber. Do you think Shish is pleased? Shish has so many coloured balls of wool. Which one do you think Shish will bring first? This wool is green. This one's purple. And this one is red. You see, Shish's wool is very warm. And you can make woolly sweatshirts with the wool to keep you warm. Wow, isn't it lucky we all have such thoughtful friends? See you all next time! Bye bye! What a lovely day! Hi, Zizi! What are you doing? Ah, you're waiting for the bakery to open so you can have some yummy cakes! There sure are lots of them with many different shapes and sizes! Yum, yum, yum! What's that noise? Ah, it's Fernando! What a spectacular entry, Fernando! What's that noise? Is that Grandpa's tractor? It's Hippo with his new wheels! Hi, Hippo! Yes, Hippo! So many cakes to choose from! Square cakes, triangular cakes, rectangle cakes, and circle cakes! Lots of yummy circle cakes! You're right, Fernando! Your skateboard wheels are circles! What other shapes can you see in those yummy, yummy cakes, Hippo? Speaking of shapes, let's see what other shapes we can see! We're on Shape Street after all! Find more shapes, guys! Find more shapes! That's right, Zizi! This pavement is made of squares! Well done, Hippo! You have spotted brightly coloured doors! They're rectangles! Oh no! Fernando! Zizi, Hippo, go and check on him! Are you okay, Fernando? Ah, oh, yes! But you really should look where you're going! At least you've spotted a triangle! They're often used as street signs! And look at the floor! Lots of rectangles on that zebra crossing! That's right, Zizi! The zebra crossing is named after you! Because you have the same colours! Zebra crossings are used for safely crossing the road! 
I bet you're all hungry after all the sheep spotting. Is the bakery open yet? opens the bakery. Zizi, shall we see how good you are with shapes? Zizi, what shape is this cake? One, two, three, four equal sides. A square. Fernando, what shape is your cake? One, two, three. Great, Fernando! A triangle has three sides. Hippo, what shape have you got? Hippo, I hope circles taste good too. I hope you enjoyed your time on Shape Street. See you next time. Bye bye. Steamed up.